Yo, what's up guys? Hope you're having an epic day today. I just had an incredible meeting. Big things happening with Daily Driven Exotics. This gas pump does not like me. Ah, what the hell? Really? Man, that thing's sensitive. All right, big things happening with Daily Driven Exotics. Just had a meeting. We just found a new DD headquarters. Super excited to tell you guys all about it. Unfortunately, I can't give you too many details quite yet. Just know that there's something in the mix and on the way. Doing some errands. I actually brought, you guys know Dave. Hey. So we have to run into town. We have um, a merch line that we've been building and it's uh, it's been a painstaking process. However, we have some clothing that we want to send out to some very grateful fans and we're just going to drive into Victoria, go pick up some blank shirts so that we can get it to them as soon as possible, get these printed, shipped off to them and just take care of that. So there's a couple of things that we just got to do, running some errands in the Scud and uh, bringing you guys with us. So let's enjoy the sights of the Scuderia on our way into Victoria. in here somewhere there it is this is a titanium nixon titanium nixon part of my old nixon collection needs a new battery and then it's going to go to a brand new owner it's got to get it replaced down at watch it here at the mall so we got a couple of minutes while the watch gets the new battery put in what did you think of the new dd space it's awesome it's huge it's I think it's really gonna be epic. We'll be able to do a lot with it because it is a lot of space. We'll be able to get multiple cars in there, some other toys. So we have a couple of surprises coming. We do. We're talking about the gaming situation. Why don't we why don't we release a little info on, on that or do we not want to do that yet? Uh we haven't signed, so let's hold off. <laughs> okay. Let's hold off. I'm super you excited. Hint, you can hint at it. Listen, though. to do with the gaming where like I get to play you guys and hopefully win. And if someone beats me, because I'm gonna be so good. <laughs> Uh, we'll give out prizes for when people beat me and then we're obviously going to upload the video footage of you playing me online and we'll have like one day a week where we do something fun like that. What else we got on the go? Uh, we have some new merch coming very soon. Like our actual DD stuff's coming. Keychains which we showed before, the lanyards, the wristbands um, and we've had we've got hats. We've got hats that are finally starting to come in. So we're gonna have the camel hat with the white lettering and a black hat with the tricolor Italian lettering. Yep, that's a good question. What's that? What's the update on the Huracan? Because people are messaging and asking that question every day. Yeah, and I do have an update. I just got an update actually from Scotty uh, within this next couple of weeks. I'm gonna go down to California, pick up the car, bring it back to British Columbia, which means if I'm driving it all the way back, we gotta schedule those meet and greet locations yeah. for people to come in see the car and come out if they want to say hi because I'm going to drive the entire west coast of uh, the U.S. yet again and I think we should have some places to meet people, yeah. major cities. Yeah. Where would you guys want me to stop uh, between Newport Beach and, and Vancouver, British Columbia on the west coast? We've got what, San Francisco, Seattle, Portland. Portland's a good one. Can you think of anything else? Leave a comment. Let's find out. Yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know where you guys think we should stop on my road trip back from Cali to British Columbia with a Huracan. Should we go see if the battery on the watch is done? Yeah. Let's do it. How do we do? New battery? All good. Yay. Good to go. There you are. Awesome. No what? charge on it. No charge? No charge. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, I thought we were shaking hands. We're, oh, that was oh, so awkward at first. No, it was very uncomfortable. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, no I appreciate it. No worries. I love this watch. This is the titanium one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, you knew yeah, right away when I you picked knew. it up. I walked in here last time for a battery and I left with a new pair of sunglasses. How long have you been following the brand? Uh, for a while now, actually. Fan follower, <laughs> DDE. Mom has a Gallardo, which is so sick. It's definitely and it, fun. And it's going to come to Victoria. It is. Which I'm super happy and grateful for because it's another exotic on the island. There's yeah. so few of them. I know. Uh, definitely nice. What do I owe you for the shoes? Uh, 
Uh, 179.20. Alright. Okay. Hey. Wait, what car did you drive here? The Ferrari. Oh. It's upstairs. Oh, it's very nice. I will come back and buy another pair of shoes. Okay. And, and if you have time, I'll show you the car. Seriously? Yeah. No way. You I mean you work here full time, half part time? Full time. I'm here, here all the time. And name again? Tiana. Tiana. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Thanks for your help. Nice meeting you. Have a great day. Bye. Ooh, it's close to the curb. We gotta pay for parking. I got the left. Alright, so we came for American Apparel. No longer here. On to the next place. Okay, you found, you found something? Yeah. What'd you find? Uh, XL uh, small. Perfect. We'll grab those two. And we have her looking for us for something else. Yeah. Excellent. So we've got her on the hunt for a double XL because I need one of those. My favorite socks. I'm just going to plug them because they don't give me free socks or anything, but they should. The best. Whoops. These are the best no show socks. These are what I'm wearing right now. I bought six pairs of these and I've been putting on a new pair of socks for the last week, taking them out of the package. Best feeling ever. You guys like socks? You want no show? and that are gonna stay on your heel and not slide off, those are the ones. What are these? Are you going snowboarding or lumberjack? What are you doing? Coffee? You said you want coffee? Yes. Let's find a coffee shop. That place down there one? Yes. Let's go down there. Hi. Hey guys. How are you? Good, how are you? Awesome. You're buying? Yeah. What is going on? Yeah. Dave's buying coffee. It's actually declining. Can you help me out here? <laughs> Cheers, buddy. Thanks for the coffee. Okay guys, it's about time that we go in, well, it'll be upside down, sell this watch. The guy who's buying it is gonna come into town and meet me because we ran out of time to get back out to where he is because of all the traffic, because now we're into rush hour. Anyhow. Watch is gone to a new owner. Uh, I know he'll appreciate it way more than I will. It's been sitting on basically my dresser for the last nine months, not being worn, where the battery was dead in the whole nine yards. So I have a real issue around kind of buying stuff spontaneously and then collecting it, like getting on a shoe kick or a watch kick or a hat kick or a hoodie kick or whatever, or car kick. Then you don't like anything super exciting and then the novelty wears off and I don't turn around and sell it even though it's most of the time very lightly used and in great condition so my wife and I have been making an effort especially now that we're moving to sell a bunch of our stuff maybe I should put nah, most of the time we put it online and it's sold so quickly or else I'd start listing stuff on the YouTube channel for you guys people would be calling me <laughs> I want to buy this or that <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. that might get a little crazy that's anyhow I'm glad to get rid of some of the stuff that I have and uh, that other people are going to appreciate it a lot more than I was appreciating it. So I wanted to ask you guys really quick before I start driving here and I'm on the road, leave some comments below or questions that you'd want me to answer because I want to start consistently doing, right Dave, we were talking about doing the comment box, kind of like my, my version of Q&A about either the, the company or myself or whatever. The only way to make that happen is, is leave a comment down below in this video and then I'll go back and I will answer some of those while filming, if that makes any sense. I'm gonna upload that on, what day were we thinking? Thursdays? Yep. Thursdays, we could do, every Thursday we do an episode of the comment box. I don't I need a better way of doing it. Oh, thanks man. You like the car? Oh fuck, unbelievable man, unbelievable. This thing is so sweet. <laughs> unbelievable, yeah, very sick. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, absolutely love it man. Just gonna take a couple pictures, is that all right? Yeah, absolutely. Cool, awesome. Go for it. So we, we need a better system though of how, how do people a ask questions? Instagram? I don't know. I don't have Twitter. Do we need to get Twitter? Why don't you guys comment? How do you, what's the best method for you guys to ask questions so that I can answer them on an episode of the comment box on the channel? Or a QA. and a Yeah. How do all the other YouTubers do it? There's a killer movie planned tonight. What over movie? At the Capital Six. What is it? It's a one-time showing, a screening of a movie called The Green Hell. It's a two-hour documentary on the Nordschleife, the circuit in Germany, the yeah. road racing track. Yeah. Um, anyways, yeah. I don't know if you're around. It's uh, like I say, it's supposed to be unreal, and it's all about 
high-speed supercars and Formula One cars racing around a track. I won't be able to make it, but I'm now going to look it up. Yeah. Do it. I appreciate sure it. it sure. Thank you, dude. You bet, man. Later. Take it easy. Total random stranger. Love the info. Uh, it would be super cool to check it out. It would. About the... Um, I can't say that word. The Nordschlaf? <laughs> Nord 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 so, yes. How do we basically communicate with you guys so that you can ask questions and I can answer them in a Q&A session and we're gonna title it the comment box or whatever and we'll include it in an episode. So it's not just a boring video of me, blah, 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 blah. It'll be like in the middle of the video, uh, I'll answer a bunch of questions and then we'll continue on with the video. Yeah. Sounds good. Leave a comment. We'll think about it. Leave a comment in yeah. this for now. What are we doing? We're heading, we gotta head back. We gotta drop the Scud back off in the garage. And we gotta hit the road. We got a conference call, another work call to do. And um, then I got dinner with the family. And you gotta get back to the wife. And you got some work and stuff. So let's just uh, let's just start heading out of town. Well, that's a wrap for uh, the scud action today. Dave and I need to head back up island, get back to the wives. The wives are needing us. Thanks for watching today's vlog. Hope you guys found it entertaining. We'll give them the rest of the updates on the on the DD new studio. The whole concept of having a place for daily driven exotics is somewhere we can park the cars and build a studio and have somewhere to film that's like on set or on location and we can just do a bunch of different stuff. Like, I don't know, maybe I wanna change the wheels on the Ferrari. I'll do it myself. Or change the oil. Yes. That sounds really ballsy and like a really bad idea because I know that they all have special tools yeah. to take even yeah. the oil filters off these cars. But hey, maybe I'm gonna be dumb enough to try it in a future episode or whatever it is. But we just want a space that's like just a DDE man cave garage. I'm sure you guys can relate to that. That's kind of the concept. That's gonna come in a couple of months. I got dinner with my wife. He's got dinner with his wife. So we're gonna bounce. I'm just gonna spin you guys right back to my house. Yo, what's up guys? We're back at my house here in beautiful Maple Bay. Dave, thanks for the ride, brother. You're welcome, anytime. Safe ride home, yeah, enjoy your it. dinner. I'm gonna go uh, do shoe review, <laughs> my new shoes. Okay, dude, call me later. Yeah, see you later. Ciao. Hello, bought some new shoes. Hi, Presley, how was your day? Presley, daddy got new shoes. Take them to mom. Go show her. That I said that I liked, but we didn't have time to buy them. These ones. What do you think, Presley? Oh, you found the stuffy. Dinner time? I'm super hungry. Okay, I'm gonna quickly eat. I think you're next.